Hello YouTube and welcome to Fixit Summer channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to make the smallest and coolest air compressor you have ever seen on YouTube. So let's get started. Okay, so for this project we need a syringe. I got a 2 O's syringe, 9 volt battery, 6 to 9 volt mini air pump, quarter inch tube like this one, on off switch and a 9 volt connection. Okay, so now we're going to prepare our syringe. If you look closely to the motor, you're going to see four holes like this. This is where the air comes in and this is where the air comes out. So we're going to make sure once we put inside the tube like this, we're going to make sure to make some holes around here and on the other side to make sure to have a good air circulation. And now we're going to make also a hole over here. This is for our on off switch. There you go. Okay, so I'm going to be using the 532 drill bit. There you go, so we got two holes for air circulation and this one is for the on off switch. And now it's time to do the wiring. And now we're going to connect our on off switch. So this is how our connection is supposed to be. We got the 9 volt connection, the red wire goes to the on-off switch, from the on-off switch to the motor, and the black wire goes directly to the motor. And now we're gonna plug our battery and make sure that our on-off switch is working fine. Everything is okay. And now we're gonna put some electrical tape around our on-off switch because we don't want the wires to touch the battery or the motor. There you go. And I have over here the quarter inch plastic tube. I'm gonna cut one inch long. And now we're gonna install our small tube. And now we're gonna add some electrical tape because we want it to fit very tight inside the tube. And make sure you don't block the holes over here. Okay, now that I've put electrical tape, we're gonna make sure the tube is straight because when we push it inside, the tube must go till here. So we're gonna make sure like it's very straight and now we're gonna put it inside and you're gonna see now you see the tube over here there you go it's about till here now so now we don't have any air leak and it's gonna pump air properly and now we're gonna place our on off switch into its position and now we're gonna secure it in its place And over here I got the cover so what I'm gonna do is 
I'm going to put them next to each other and I'm going to measure exactly where our on off switch ends and then I'm going to cut right here. And now we're going to cut this part over here inside. Okay, so after cleaning this part, all what we have to do is to plug our battery and simply put it like this and push it down. As you see, it's working. All what's left to do is try it. And if you ever need to change the battery, it's very simple. Just pull like this and remove the old battery, plug the new one, and you're done in a few seconds. And what's nice about this project, you got the hook over here so you can put it anywhere you want. And it's very small and practical. And it works perfectly. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Fix This Ammo. And we will see you next time.